I don't know if I've actually gotten this to work yet. Start streaming. Uh... Is this working? I have no idea. Disconnect this. I really don't know if this is working or not. I can't even really put my... I have no tripod on this thing. What a, uh... What a conundrum. Put this in my pocket. Actually, let me take this thing out. One second. I, I have to use, like, a second phone to look at chats now. Hold on. I have a... A thingamabob that I may use at some point. It's the, uh... DJI microphone. I don't know if I'm going to use it yet, but oh, that's me. If you can see me, I have to open another phone right now. Give me a second. So in theory, DJI device disconnected. What, what does that mean? I don't know about that. Let's go to YouTube. You. Uh, let me use my Android phone. I don't even know if anybody can hear me, if this is even working. Let's try this. You. What? How do you go to your own channel? Why is it just not working? Come on now. <sighs> your videos, I guess? Live? I see nothing. Huh. Well. Ah, <sighs> boy, oh boy, oh boy, boy, oh boy. Ta -ta 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 -da -da -da. I think it's working. Alright. The Biggs and Walk Show, you sent me my own video link. Isn't this hilarious? I can't find my own link. Ah, oh, my body. Alright, let me... Okay. That worked. Thank you. Looks like it's working all right. All right, who do I see? Wizard of Iza, Gigi, Biggs and Walk Sean, thanks for the uh, the link to my own video. Why, 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 why was I not seeing it in my own? I mean, am I an idiot? Yes. Am I that big of an idiot? I don't know. Yeah, I guess yes is the answer. Let me just get, get some gloves on here. I need a way to hold both phone and gimbal. Um, so I have a clamp coming and something else to hold it, but I don't know. Maybe I should hold it in my left hand and I can use my right hand to scroll around. All right. So, let me get both gloves on so I'm ready to go. I do feel a couple of flakes. It's not dandruff, as far as I know. Uh, that's actually going to be hard to hold the phone and scroll. Well, let's see. Hold the message. Let me see. Is something... I'll have to respond to you later. Alright. Coming a lot. So I'm not using the microphone, uh, you know, the wireless microphone. This is the internal pocket microphone from the Pocket 3. Peter Bradfield. Yes, wear the snow. Ah, Florian, Abe, Nava, Josie, Mark T, Ricky S, It's Only Me, Flatlander, Tamara Britton, Jasmine. We're right on 34th and 1st. Gerard, Tony D, Moon, Kevin. Uh, I see a couple of flakes. I'm still a little bit sniffly, so I apologize for that. But, you know, to test, we must overcome our limitations 
You hear me, but I don't sound like me. Yeah, I, I don't know if that's partly because of my stuff sniffles or because the, the microphones are different in the D DJI Pocket 3. Philip, Little G, Ashna, someone said, oh, who said it's snowing? Joe C said it's already snowing in Central Jersey. Aha. Otter, Maryland is sleeting, Stex, good morning. Sorry, uh, that doesn't sound too fun, actually. Uh, Mars and Worldwide Angel is here, good morning. Afternoon, sorry. Susan, good to, good to see that you hear me. Do say may the force be with you. Abe doing all right, how are you? Dwayne is here, RJ Jones, Chris Bates. I see Moon. Kevin Park and his coffee farts, what a day. Jen Klaus, happy Saturday. The problem is with this current setup is I have to hold the gimbal, you know, pocket and phone, one in each hand to read the chat and to stream. So either I need an attachment for my backpack or I need uh, something else because if it starts to be raining, I can't, uh, you know, the umbrella is an issue. Anyway, the weather forecast predicts nothing nothing substantial from what I saw when I checked. Uh, Danny, hello. Good to see you. Sharon. Roxanne with a $5 super chat. Thank you, Roxanne. Appreciate your support during these odd testing times. I'm using a completely different system, as you can see. This is a uh, Pocket 3 uh, device that I'm being... Uh, using the, the, the live streaming functionality from the DJI Mimo app, and this is going to uh, an RTMP. I don't know. I don't know like the, what what the name of the protocol really is, but that's uh, in my backpack uh, installed on a, on a Radsa Rock 5A with the Bellabox software on it, and then I have a wireless router that's providing the Wi-Fi for all this right now. Uh, so I don't, you know, I don't really know how to explain it at this point. Uh, let's just walk and see what happens. So far, it seems to be working okay. Chrissy, happy birthday to your daughter. Yeah, what happens if I need to do the umbrella? I have no idea. Uh, I think we'll have to stop or something because uh, I'm not ready for that. This is just a simple wireless test. It's probably not the best time to do this when it's snowing or potentially raining outside, but are the metal seats cold to sit in? They're not comfortable, but you get used to it. You know, either your butt warms up the seat or the seat cools down your butt, but it all kind of evens out in the end. Steven in the suburbs, not much. A little bit here. It's starting a little bit. I see droplets on my phone from the snow immediately melting as soon as it hits it. Winter is coming, supposedly, but... Yeah, that's the cool thing about this. So the Pocket 3 is lighter, but I'm trying to set up a certain way to have, like, uh... To still be able to carry the phone and the pocket in the same... In the same, uh... Configuration. If that makes sense. Uh, I guess I should start moving and see what happens. Flakes and Queens. I'm not there. I'm just kidding. Hey girl, happy new year. Okay, now what about this? Like, so I have the uh, the wireless microphone queued up. Uh, I double checked and stereo does work on a live stream with the Pocket 3. Uh, actually, I can hear myself, let me quiet this down. But now let me turn on the microphone, the DJI, let's see. Okay, DJI Mic 2 transmitter one connected. So now this is being used for audio. Let me know if this sounds any different. Moon, appreciate the 35 months of support. That's wild, almost three years. Allie's here. All right, let's, uh, we're not really getting much snow down here. I'm gonna start moving. Let me know, well, should I, should I stick, before I move, should I stick to this microphone or the, uh, <laughs> the internal one? You like the sharpness of the other audio, but Sherry likes this sound. It's gonna be different. The background noise is gonna be less. But you're gonna hear my voice better, I guess. But Jimmy also thinks it's less. You like the ambient sound, no background noise. Uh, so th if this is two and the other one is one, I guess put, put your preference, one or two.
It sounds like there's wow, people are really split down the middle. You know, let me save the battery. I feel like using extra microphones is just gonna bog down the battery. So let me. Uh, it's it really is split down the middle. Wow, this is really split. Holy moly. I'm starting to see more ones. Okay, let me turn off the microphone. I'll uh, I'll turn it back on later if it gets too windy. What the heck? Oh, all right, fine. Let's uh, let me try to glove up again. And then see if I can actually use these gloves and scroll on my phone. Because it's hard to actually hold the phone with one hand and scroll with your thumb. Well, hopefully I don't have to scroll too much, but let's see. Hopefully I just have to hold it. Okay, we're walking. Let me know, uh, three. Stex is adding them together again. Alright, so now, uh, the flurries are coming down now. It's like in the mid-upper 30s right now. So the snow, I don't know, it'd have to be a lot of snow to accumulate uh, anything without melting. So this could be the last time the Pocket 3 is even used, uh, depending on how much snow is enough to kill it. Let me know if you see buffering or hear buffering. This is a big test of a completely new streaming system, one we've never used before. So if anything, if anything's amiss, let me know. I'm sure Big as a Walk Sean will let me know too. <laughs> you appreciate the almost scientific, but kind of haphazard approach <laughs> to all of this. I really should have used the Pocket 2. I do, do uh, remind me though, does the Pocket 2 require something weird to get the wireless to work? Or was that only the Pocket 1? I just don't remember. Because I still have the Pocket 2 and it's all crusty. So I should probably use that for weird, uh, weird streams. But like the convenience of not having the big, big gimbal is also pretty nice. But I still have to read on two screens. I mean, I have to like, I have to, it's a little different. I actually have to look where I'm going. And it kind of looks like I'm talking to myself more this way. Hold on one second, I have to... Oh boy. Uh, there we go, that's better. Anyway. Okay. Yeah, I'm using the Pocket 3 for the stream right now. Good afternoon, those joining. I see Norella's made it. My, my text is also super small on my phone, which is actually good because I don't have to scroll. It looks like 720p. That's not good. It should be 1080. Is it? Is it? It must be the adaptive bitrate. I think this encoder is supposed to be a little bit more aggressive in terms of adjusting the stream. And I really need an action cam for these kinds of wet weather events. Pick quality is a little iffy right now. Uh oh. But uh, has there been any um, any hiccups in the sound or the video? No, pretty much nothing can do mobile 4K at this point. Yeah, there's definitely snow flakes. Well, the field of light is right here. I also might be using my own. Uh, let me. I should pause my own stream. Hold on. I should pause it so that the video is not being played. Come on. There we go. All right. My chat will still work, right? Yeah, it still works. Daryl says there's snow in Chicago. Yeah, I saw from my other friend over there. Oh, is it really that low res right now? 
with the adaptations. That's interesting. I wonder why. When I was doing my testing, the bitrate was kind of through the roof. I wonder if I should just up the bitrate in the encoder itself. Because I have Bellabox limited to 5,000. The 5,000 should also be fine for 1080p. So I don't know. For all, Andrew, all social constructs more. Good afternoon, sorry. <laughs> no snow in Australia. No buffering, no lag. I mean, that's big, but I guess here, you know, there's nobody here. So we really shouldn't have any problems. That's <laughs> There's that. Yeah, 5,000 should be plenty, right? This could just be one of those limitations where people are saying that the Pocket 3 just doesn't have the, uh, a very good uh, wireless mode. The quality might just not be there because of that. I guess the other option is to test this again on the iPhone with my big, big setup and use Moblin. Moblin. If anyone remembers that. Nobody knows that. It's kind of a very, very, uh, a little used, very new app. You see this flake? I got flakes on my glove. It's pixelating a lot, a bit, says Moon. I see. Sound can't read the signs. Oh boy. Oh, they canceled the light because of the rain. Well, honor the tickets another night. I mean, it never looks super crowded, so I'm assuming they could easily do that. It jumped. What does that mean? Mm. Maybe I should keep my video going just to see how it looks. Hold on. Yeah, I might just keep... Uh I don't know, just keep me informed. I got the video running on my iPhone. I mean, on my, on my Pixel. To kind of read the chat and also see what's happening with the stream. But like when I'm looking at such a small screen, it looks fine to me, but... You know... It's like a 3 by 2 inch display that I'm looking at, so it's not like it's very... The Ninja Turtles are vaping. Oh boy. And then the Action 4 is another potential test. With, uh... Alright. Yeah, I should probably get this on my backpack strap again. What are the pipes for? Well, the pipes that are in the middle of the roads, that are like the, the orange and white striped ones, are just there to exhaust steam, but to bring it above eye level, you know, above people's heads, that's very hot steam. Several hundred degrees, apparently. Yeah, we got legit snowflakes. It could be, in, in theory, something good, but I think it's all going to turn to rain by later this evening. So there's that. Anyway, I'm going to run up to Tudor City. Let's see how it handles me going up the stairs. And then we'll still head towards, you know, the big sites that we usually go to. Is it really hard to, like, uh, make stuff out? I should turn on my, uh, my heated gloves just in case. Because I'm moving nothing. I'm, moving, I'm not moving my hand, my fingers. Hey, GPT still works. Ice crystals, huh? Virtual Japan streams in the Pocket 3, but it's clear. And he does live streams? Or they do live streams? They salted up the stairs significantly here. Which is good. They're ready. It actually feels kind of slippery with all the salt. Wizard of is still here. Good, good. I don't know if it's a bleeding edge taxi, but I feel like we're uh, we're getting into some real enthusiast territory here. Uh, 
Uh, right in Tudor City now. No. Above 42nd Street where everyone likes to take pictures during Manhattan Henge. And it doesn't seem like it's a too big of a delay. Yeah, much colder yesterday than today. All right. Can you tell that it's snowing on the stream? They are visible, says Victoria. Great, great. With the cool, huh? Snowmageddon. I don't know if I go that far. It's snowing snowmen directly out of the sky. Pre-built snowmen. Oh my goodness. And Dre, glad you're enjoying. Cool. Did I not say hello to Ambrose? I don't think so. And there is a good amount of snow. Like, it's not like blizzard levels, obviously, but. Frozen 3, I'm walking here. Let me walk, let me walk, let me walk in this dang city. Is it sticking? Nah, not really. You could see them falling on the ground and kind of hanging around for a second, but I think it's too warm. Well, they're also melting directly on my phone, so that's great. Stabilization is great, smoother than my normal setup. Smoother than my gigantic gimbal? I hate that. Ford Foundation. They were saying how the, the atrium is closed. I don't know that it ever reopened, but we could take a look and see if the sign is still up. I think it is. Garden is closed. Yes, yeah, so the garden's still closed. Don't know how long it's gonna be closed for, but it's closed. Tax can hear the audio from your rear speakers too. Well, it should only be stereo at most. I feel like that could be a receiver setting on your end. Uh, sometimes receivers try to upscale stereo into like 3D audio, but there aren't actually five discrete tracks, if that makes any sense. Am I going uptown or downtown? We're kind of in the uptown trajectory, uh, now going a little bit more west. I mean, I, it's definitely snowing. I mean, you can't you can't deny that it's snowing. You can't deny that it's yeah. Anyway, let's go into uh, let's go to Grand Central, I guess, and see how it does in there. The Dutch is near Sax. I'm assuming he's not having. Too many problems in terms of uh, in terms of uh, service right now. I'm assuming there's less people. But you let me know. I haven't seen that one, Darrell, but it sounds like it could be pretty good. It has the thunder cast with snow outside. It is very, very lightly. Got a very light bit of snow. Based on what I saw in the forecast, it's all going to turn to uh, to rain later on today. Justine, hello. Fum Marie, hi. Oh, there's still a lot of people. Okay. Having trouble focusing. Hmm. I also may have forgotten to switch it back from ultra low latency. See if it was a long shot. It may be on ultra low. I don't, I'm not sure off the top of my head if I if I adjusted it or not. Fiddler's Green is here. How much snow is predicted? Uh, I think some of the numbers said one to three. I think it's gonna be even less than that at this point. 
Ambrose is having trouble focusing. Do you want to make a sniffle? <laughs> Depth of field is off. I don't know. I think that's probably bit rate related. If I had to guess. But I don't know why the bit rate would be so weird right now. It doesn't make sense. It should be maxing out. I probably just need to set it to higher bit rate in my uh, in my app. Yeah, the app is internal to the DJI Pocket. I could always switch it to my external one, but I'm letting it use the internal one for now to see how the whole stream goes. Mrs. Commuter has made it in to watch this experiment unfold as my Pocket 3 gets wetter and wetter. But in case you're wondering, I am. This is this is what... You should be able to see my reflection here, hopefully. I don't know what's easier, but it is just using a small little camera. I'm waiting to see if I can see it on the video. Eh, vaguely. I'm sure we'll find a mirror or something if you want to see what it looks like. Is NYC quite subdued post-holidays? January blues? I think things, um, you know, by mid-January, things go into a bit more of a lull. Well, let's see what it's like this year. I don't know. This whole year has been busier than, than even the last year before the pandemic, so let's go through the market in Grand Central and see how it goes in there. Cross and go to the market. Let's see if I actually, here's another limitation. I have like no hands to open the door, so I'm gonna try my best to use my finger to pull it open or I'll piggyback. Right, thank you. Thanks. Okay. Seven Chobers made it, hello. Let me know how it looks inside the market to Grand Central. Seems to be okay for now. Luciano Vicente with a four euro super chat. Thank you, Luciano. Appreciate it. Is it Luciano or Luciano? Let me know. Steve, hey. An Avril and Loki, of course. Um, we're, uh, we're not really going to get that much snow. It's going to be very light on the snow. Stutter to enter. Is Stutter for anybody else? <laughs> Christian Hansen, hello. <laughs> We don't have enough cheese. I think, I think there's tons of cheese here, so uh, <laughs> don't worry about it. Video quality is not as high. So I don't know if there's anything I could do to adjust that. I might have to do one of those things where I just sit down and like mess with settings until uh, until we get it figured out. I don't know. Because right now. It buffered there? How badly? Quick buffer. Alright. I mean, I can't imagine it's going to be perfect, but... I think this encoder probably is a lot more, uh... A lot more... Aggressive in dropping down... Oh, a little bit of a jump there too, it seems. I'm just looking at the, uh, you might be hearing my voice in a delay. Paul Little, happy weekend. All right, let's, uh, let's go to the main concourse area. Aggressive. 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 
But like, let's look at the text. So is the text readable in something like this? Can you read that? Where are the drunkards? Why, why are you looking for those? Raukfer? Ragfer. Yeah, that's readable. That's not readable. Well, um, oh, here, here's a smaller text on the uh, on the map of Grand Central. Well, it's not really that small of a text. Anyway. Okay. Sorry, that's I know it's very exciting. I think I ate too much food for lunch. I also have no idea if I do have to use the bathroom how that's gonna work. But uh, you know, we'll cross that bridge when we get there. How is it in the middle of Grand Central now? Is the quality still uh, questionable? The distance is out of focus. I don't know if that's really, if that's like actually out of focus or just a uh, bit rate. Oh, the testing constructor, we can't stop. Oh gosh, I just saw how jarring the uh, the adjustment of the camera was. So I'll try not to recenter it. I can't really, I have to switch it to follow mode, I think, if I really want to be. Uh... Oh, let me go to that section where they had the shops before. That always buffered, right? By the uh, exit, and then I think I'll head towards the uh, the Helmsley building. <laughs> With this whole setup, I can't tell if I'm. Uh, I won't be able to know if I'm actually buffering real time. That's fine. It is what it is. All right, well, oh, they put up something else over here. An expansion? Uh, looks like they're doing some more stuff here. We'll see. Get buffered quick for everyone. Oh yeah, there's a cool chan chandelier. Uh, the one right over here, it kind of is also very interesting behind the flag here in this little area. These chandeliers right, chandeliers right here are very cool. Thanks, construction constructor. All right, I apologize that I'm gonna recenter this in a very jarring way. Okay, let's go outside. We'll zoom on a dirty spot on the ceiling. I don't think I, I don't think I can easily zoom in. That's the other limitation. I'm not gonna be able to zoom in as much as I uh, as I can when I'm using the iPhone. So maybe that is another reason that the iPhone will be a better option for this. Keep our testing going as much as we can. But so far, Grand Central, I think it's gone pretty well. Let me know if you had any. So it's very ag aggressive about adjusting the quality. Interesting. Like, on my little screen here, it looks like it's okay. But again, the screen is so small in terms of the size that it could probably be 480p and I wouldn't be able to tell the difference between that and uh, 1080 Anyway, let's see what happens when we get out here.
Still seems to be okay. Oh, there was a small one approaching the uh, the doors. I saw that. Actually, is mine still even fully live? Yeah. All right. Well, let's exit the MetLife building towards the Helmsley building. I mean, glitchy is better than, like, completely broken, right? Max Headroom is here. And she likes the brutalist space. Brutal. I'm mapping the reception of data in my seat. Well, what I have in my backpack is a, uh... Does the setup feel more discreet? It does. But like in a way, I don't know if that's a good thing or not. I know I mentioned it to you before, Big Walk Sean, but I, sometimes I feel like having a big, a big uh, gimbal and more out in the open looking display of like equipment makes it seem like you belong more in terms of filming. And like, it's like, ah, that guy knows what he's doing. Not that I do but I want to look like I do. And I feel like people don't ask me, because if you're walking around with like a discreet little camera, have people notice, it's like, oh, that guy trying to be just a little bit too discreet? It's kind of creepy, huh? <laughs> I don't know. Like, this is the, the rabbit hole thinking I get myself into. Uh, but uh, it was nice being inside because everything wasn't getting wet. But anyway, that's not, that's not gonna be the bottom line. I'll have to review the stream later on my big, high-res computer screen just to see how bad things look. Because the other the other th thought is it could just be OBS. Um, it could be OBS at a lower bit rate than it's supposed to be, but I don't think it's that. Ooh, was that a little bit more? I don't know. Oh, I just saw a jump. What's that biker? Sounds like uh, he might not be long for the street. Oh, is Ron here? Ron, how you doing? What's going on? This is the test for New Year's Eve 2025. Well, I think what what I wanted to do... Yeah, I don't know that we're going to get much actual snow. It's, this might be like the extent of it. I guess we'll see. I think that the way to get New Year's is to start the stream as early as possible. So I think I'm going to start the New Year's Eve 2025 stream right now. And then um, just just keep going until New Year's Eve. <laughs> right now, until December thirty first, and we're gonna go right right through until the ball drop. We're gonna do the whole thing, whole year, in one stream. Imagine. You would up the max bit rate, okay? Maybe that's what I'll do. I know the bit rate on. Um, the bitrate on OBS, I think it's it's like a 10,000 right now. It did its own uh, auto testing and it got itself to 10,000. Oh gosh, I, I didn't realize I might have missed that, Ron. I'm sorry to hear about the passing of your friend. Yeah, we're gonna go. best. Stephanie's getting some snow. Still sniffling, sorry. Yeah. I, I'd like 8k lives, yes. Well, this whole stream is a test, so that's why it's even in the title. We're going to be talking a lot about the technical aspects of the stream as we uh, as we walk around New York. And, well, you know, hopefully the Pocket 3 doesn't die. Because I, I really don't think I'm going to have enough money this month to uh, buy a bunch of new things.
Did we hear John Mayer at some point recently? I feel like I... I just want to sing that, uh... Song, for some reason. Me and all my friends are on the summer still. I sing this stuff for nothing, and there's no way we can ever come. No? I don't know. Sometimes I thought I heard that. Just now. Testing for a trip to Disney World. Or St. Patrick's Day. It's really a test for any kind of, uh... Really busy, uh... really busy area of anywhere. I only need, um, I'm gonna try to cross. Yeah. Cross it. I only need one more, like, hotspot. So the problem with this current setup is I no longer have T-Mobile in, in the mix. There's no T-Mobile in my current mix of devices. It's only AT&T and, uh, Verizon. Let me know the nature of the buffers too when you when you see them. Is it like a, a blip in the video and audio? Is it more than just a blip? Did you miss what I was saying? Like, uh, yeah. I'm all, I'm curious as to the descriptors. Uh, Mary Reed, a picture on Wesley live stream she passed recently. Sorry, I'm so sorry, Ron. Deepest condolences. That name is actually familiar, and I think I have seen her in other streams. She might have even been in ours from time to time, too. I know our, our timing is different from the others, but yeah. Either way. It's always sad to lose anyone that you know and can respect and appreciate. Audio seemed fine there, got it, okay. Oh, CFOTS also. Yeah, she was there. That's great. It's great that she was able to be with us and contribute and help. So all we can do is remember, you know, the good times. Uh, I'm approaching Saks, which already took down all of their, uh, they took down all their windows displays. I think what Saks is going to do is take all of the, the window displays and just, uh, the, the new display is just going to be a big middle finger in every single window. And the message is going to be, screw you, get out of New York, the holidays are over. I'm kidding. Oh yeah, there's no there's no point in waiting for the left turn signal because you can't drive into the street anyway. Well, that's right, Fang as well. No. This is so many less people. Like, I don't know if you can tell how many less people this is, but I'm like walking comfortably. Can I whisper loudly? I could also bring the whole thing up to my mouth and it would be like very, very intimate. This is more like ace. I don't know, what does this sound like? I mean, look, we can like walk up and down this entire area without, without being stuck. Gosh, the, the droplets are getting kind of... It's still technically snowing, but as soon as it hits, it's uh, it's converting to uh, agua. Let me... Oh gosh, I tried to do a rub down of my phone. A rub down, is that the right word? No, it's not. I mean, this is... Well, I feel like the test then is to go... Because we always have a hiccup 
regardless of how busy it is when we approach Sixth Avenue on 48th Street. Street. So let's go out to the side there and uh, let's see what happens. But Tish is not going to help at this point. It's just going to be like a. Um, just a battle that has no end. It'll be like. Um, like plugging up a fire hydrant with a, t with a Kleenex. <laughs> if that makes sense. Three degrees too warm. Well, for the weather forecast, all says it's going to be rain by the night. So I don't know. We'll see. I mean, look at this. They had the street closed down. There's still barely anybody out here, though. Holidays are done. Go home. I also wonder how long the Nintendo store line is now. Remember that thing was going down the block? The F.A.O. Schwartz line is also very short, so that, that's a big indicator, too. There's a tree. Gotta switch the joystick speed. Let me try to manually bring it down. To, there we go. Oh, gosh. Uh, let me know whatever you see. Like, can I actually adjust the bitrate myself right now, you think? You think if I go into the bellow box and try to max it out more, it'll actually affect it? I don't know. I think I have to probably turn it off to actually do that test. Plus, I got gloves on and all that. Maybe if we find a place with some cover, I can consider that. But it is snowing. Can't deny that. Yeah, the ground temperature's warmer. It's like, uh, it's the same principle, you know, with the bridges, the roads on bridges freeze before the the ground that's not suspended in the air because there's no warmer temperature soil or whatever under it. It's all air. So they freeze. So it is, it is 9 out of 10, and it's still pretty good quality. At times, it goes down when the other one will probably drop completely. So that's good, less jarring. 320 days till the next SantaCon. It's the worst possible day of the year. Where their Santas are drinking and spinning and farting and crapping everywhere. Or something. Ah. Yeah, this, the flakes are all very clumpy, but they're also immediately melting on all my gear. Oh, the balls are gone. Christmas is over. The balls are gone. I got no balls left. It's, it's over. Everything is wet. I really wish I had that cl that gimbal clamp on my backpack strap for the pocket. Flashlights on. All right, was there any hiccups there? Because you usually get hiccups right at that corner when I cross the street. Ah, Mercury Mom was Josh is here. Yeah, we're... This is the stream where we, um, we're we trying to make enough money to buy a new Pocket 3 after this one breaks because of the water. My phone is, is, you know, very wet. Thankfully, that should have some sort of water resistance. The Pocket does not! The Radio City tree is gone too. The candy canes are still up. I guess it depends on the... Uh, the building that, that is in charge of each of the displays. Uh, actually, let's go this way because that the tree with the tunnel is off, but it's still there. I wonder if uh, I wonder if Mercury Rose is at 37 months yet of support. The Rockettes must be done.
Oh, they even closed down the, uh, the stairs. You can't get down there either. Yeah, they, they fully closed it down. I guess the next step is they're taking it down completely. I wonder if you can still get to it from the train. Because that, that exit right there, over here where the glass is, there's like a train station down there. So I wonder if you can still get there somehow, but probably not. I think it leads to some, I don't know actually where it leads to. I think it does lead to a train. Yeah, because I see entrance across the street. Fox 5 tree is still up. <laughs> oh, Norell did a gift to get five memberships. Thank you, Norell. I see Ambrose, it's only me, Molly Chamber, Stephanie Gray, Connie V. It's not. It's much nicer for me actually to be able to see the chat though. Well, actually, I don't know if you can tell, but I can't read anything. It's. <laughs> oh gosh. I don't know. I don't know if there's any anything I could do here. Maybe I can find a way to hold the phone and the gimbal in one hand. If I like do some weird, uh, some weird tactics, some grip, and get the umbrella out because I. This is this is a little too much. I think. The liquid. The liquid. But thank you again, Norell. We should at least try to see the snow over the Bryant Park skating rink. That would be pretty iconic. Well, these cars are going though. The traffic still looks pretty bad. Holiday levels. But I think there might be... Mm, this is a bad idea. These cars are... Uh... They've overdone their... their magic. Let's see. Is there any over overhang here where I can maybe reconfigure? Ah, maybe. Oh, what about like one of those public plazas? Oh yeah, isn't there one on 42nd, like a indoor public area? Maybe we can get there, and I can try to reconfigure myself at that area. Let, let me let me test the thing. Let me test it. Let's see, can I hold my phone and the gimbal? Yeah, I kind of can. I could. Sort of. Yeah. I can kind of hold both of them in one hand. I can get the umbrella out, maybe. I don't know. Oh, shoot. <laughs> I pressed too much. Oh, no. I switched to Baby Shark somehow. Oh, man. Hold on. I can't read anything. The weird thing is, like, on my own videos, if I go to live, there it is, I can see it now. Okay. Carlo in Italy, hello. Alright. <laughs> I really need an attachment for this thing to be able to, to do both. Alright, I think if that outdoor or that, that indoor plaza public area is open, I'll try to go in there and, uh, Maybe pull my umbrella out and uh, practice holding the phone and gimbal at the same time. Oh, this is a nice little overpass, overhang. I could walk right here for a little bit. Let me do that. Protect myself. Economical pogo, hello. Yeah, right. But I like. I went to my own channel, Vegas Walk Shot. I went to live. And it's not even there. It's it's just not there. Ah. NYC got hello. Yeah, I have some some ways coming in that I'll be able to hold the two at the same time in one hand comfortably. Uh, I'm not there yet, but. Yeah, I think if I if I play with bitrate settings a little bit more, maybe that's the maybe that yeah. If we get inside, maybe I'll do that also. Maybe I'll see if I can access the Bellabox cloud interface and uh, up the uh, the max bitrate. 
try to hit 6,000 on it. It also could be the DJI. No, I already did everything I could there. Oh, I have DJI on auto. Maybe I should have had it on, on smooth, on ultra. The DJI Mimo app also has some settings, Big to Walk Sean. Ah. <laughs> he always knows Batman. Uh, Batman. <laughs> That's sorry. That didn't sound anything like any Batman. Just tape the phone to the gimbal. Double sided tape. Oh, someone was eating rock candy. I'm gonna wait for the light to change. I'm gonna wait like right here under an umbrella momentarily. It's not really helping that much, but. See the corner of the MetLife building or the edge of it. You don't usually see it from this end. Yeah, when you set up on the DJI Mimo app, uh, it gives you an option for auto or smooth or like HD or something. I guess in theory I could kill the stream and come back into it because the container is going to be there, right? The OBS is, is the one that's actually pushing the stream out. So if I kill my connection from here, I can always get back into it. And the cool part about this setup is I'll be able to set up, um, you know, automatic screens. So if the bit rate starts going down, uh, you'll actually get a low bit rate uh, text. If the stream drops, I can make it say BRB. I kind of like that tree in the Steinway window. With the purple blinking lights and the pink piano behind it. Nice. I would go in there and play some piano, but I think my hands, even with these gloves, my fingers are, are going to need a good little while to warm up. Anyway, there's that plaza I was talking about. Let me try to run across the street before the cars come and see if we can actually get in there. And uh, if it's open, take a break from the... Uh, where's the entrance to it? Take a break from some of the... Uh... Is it open? I see tables. I see security in there. Let's see if it's open. Hold on. Talk amongst yourselves. Let's see if it's open. Hold on. Ah, it's closed. It's closed. That's unfortunate. All right, it's closed. Well, the thought that counts. Also, is it me or like, I can't tell how many viewers are actually in the chat. It's, it's stuck at the same number of viewers. What's the actual number of folks uh, folks here? And the over, the, the, the <laughs> awning or whatever it would be called here is so high up. Oh, the elevator's out of order. Let me stay in the elevator for a second. All right. I'm going to stay in the elevator for a second. Uh, let me wipe down the phone screen. Okay. I have stupid pants, oh man. My pants aren't fabric. They're like nylon. Oh, it started updating as soon as I mentioned, okay, I see. It said 700 now, got it. Yeah, it's not working, I'm just standing here, <laughs> sorry. No, no, I don't think so, I'm just, no, no, I'm just, I'm just hiding. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Well. Let's go towards the park. They're, they're like nylon. They're like nylon. They're not like a absorbent fabric. Oh, I guess Whole Foods is open too. But I don't know that Whole Foods likes people going inside. And, and, no, actually, I'm not as a... Ah. Sniffle, sniffle. Sniffle, sniffle. 600 was a swipe key. This is power. I mean, I still, I definitely want to get some shots of, uh, of the Bryant Park skating rink, uh, with the snow. I think that's going to be important. But if I can get into Whole Foods and maybe figure out my umbrella situation, that might be helpful also. I just need a table. That's what I really need. Like, I really need a table. And I don't... Unless they have a little uh, area of eating, 
Let me let me take a look. I don't know. Cafe. Let's let's pop in for a second. I don't know. I just need I just need to remove the water from my body. I see Charlotte. Uh oh, sorry. It looks like night by time. Few times you out. Shelf his dressing room. Yes. Uh, uh, well, the seating is here, but I don't think uh, I think it's all jammed up with people, so I don't think we'll be able to sit down and uh, and do anything. This is a very nice seating area, though. Actually, no, I don't want to jam myself in there. All right, that's fine. At least we dried up a little bit. <laughs> right, Ron. I'm trying not to. Okay, I'm gonna go back outside. <sighs> I guess uh, the umbrella and all that was not meant to be. All right, I guess we're going directly outside. <sighs> Try a Starbucks. I don't need any more uh, liquid in my body. No, I always say. Anyway. Ah, oh, boy. All right, we're going back out. All right. Ooh, the snow's coming inside. The door's just always open. Everyone's coming in and out, like, all the time. Oh, the light's in our favor. Let's cross. Let's go. I mean, the snow's definitely picked up. But as you can see, it's not sticking. It's melting as soon as it hits. There are very empty uh, stores here. I wish you could just go in one of those. But they're all locked for good reason. But all the holiday shops look to be done. Oh, what about the lodge? Wait, nine hours. I really don't think it's going to get that much worse. According to the hourly, it's just going to turn to rain. But I don't know. I guess we'll see. Oh, they have some umbrellas here with seating. You think it's enough to cover us for a moment while I uh, dig in my bag? Nah, it's all wet. It's all wet. I don't know. <sighs> well, at least I can stay here for a moment. Maria, hello. All the empty shops are, are locked. They lock them. They're all they're all empty over there too, but they're all locked. I wonder if Raclette is open. Now's the time to get Raclette when there's nobody here. You think they're do you think they're done? We should check. We should check Raclette. But I want to go left also. I want to check both sides. So let's go this way first. Am I wearing a hat? No. I'm actually quite warm. I know I'm sniffly. I know all that. But I'm already sniffly because of my residual uh, whatever I had. Maybe it was human metanuma virus. Yeah, all the shops are, uh, are empty. But even the ones that don't have locks have zip ties. Oh, this... Wait, is this one open? I feel like as soon as I walk in there, someone's going to come in and say, Get out of here. Well, let me see. Let me just stand in here for a moment. Okay. <laughs> ah, how's the gimbal looking? I don't even know. I'm blowing the uh, the liquid off of the uh, the gimbal. Well, this door is open. I don't think it's supposed to be, but I'm in it. I'm standing in a booth. I was, I'm opening up my shop, my retail shop at Bryant Park. Let me turn on my gloves. I think that'll help me a little bit. 
I'll feel better anyway if it doesn't do anything anyway. Come on. Oh, is the left one dead? No, don't tell me the left one is dead. The right one works. Oh no, they both might be done. Darn it. Yeah. Oh, no, that one worked. Oh no, it's done. Ah, <sighs> fine. Alright, well anyway. Well, how's everything been otherwise with the stream? Ah, uh, yes, uh, this is gonna be up on Street Easy. Uh, Cash Jordan, come down, do a video of, uh, of, of this new and fantastic and, and, and spacious studio apartment in the heart of Bryant Park. Monthly rent, $8,500. Excuse me. Okay. Please, Bella, hello. Can I use a washroom? There is no washroom around here that's going to be easy to use. There's one room over there in that corner of the park. Uh, it's uh, is a, quite, a, quite a bit of a line, usually. Maybe less so now because of because of how fewer people there are in the weather, but I need I don't even have a tripod. See that's the other thing I forgot to do. I forgot to put a mini tripod on the uh, on the bottom of my gimbal. Alright, let's just go. I feel like we're gonna lose everyone if we just stand in one spot. Let's go. Hey, what is what is uh what is um What was Rocky's opponent Ivan Drago? If he dies, he dies. If the gim if, if the pocket dies, it dies. Or whatever. Whatever he said in the movie. I don't know. Does it have a sink spray? That's a big question. That's the number one Cash Jordan question. At least the Bryant Park tree is still up. If they're going to have the rink functioning, they should have the tree up. The music is playing here. Hopefully it's not going to get picked up too much. Ah, uh, they're about ready to Zamboni again. Looks like the ice, uh, ice needs a polish. Lodge looks pretty empty, also, actually, considering prior. Uh... Somebody took a tumble, but they're okay. It's Christmas, too. The Christmas thing. Ooh. Some of these are completely blocked off. They're they're try oh they're actively taking down booths like right now. Don't touch the tree ornament. Santa's watching is what it says. Under the anyway, let me know how the stream has been. I don't know where else to go to. Oh, oh, sorry, I'm in the way of people's photos. I want to see if Reckless open. I doubt it. Make us a walk shot. Let me know what else I should be testing. Oh, this music's gonna get us, right? Oh, oh, oh no. Raclet is done. Raclet has left us. All right. I think I really do need to find a uh, an umbrella timer thing. All right. There's an umbrella over here. Let me go to that umbrella over there. Just give me a moment to. Uh, all right. 
Okay. I can also just go on the carousel. Need to work on the video quality. Yeah. Let me uh, let me see. Let me see what I can do here. Um Well, I'm under an umbrella right now. I guess I could just stay here the whole time. All right. Uh, take a glove off. I don't want to put any of these tables or chairs because they're very wet. I can hang it from one of these cables. Yeah, I'm going to do that. I'm going to hang my glove on this table. If you want to see what I just did, I did this. All right. Oh, by the way, let's see if it's in sync. Is it in sync with my voice? I'm gonna, I'm gonna reverse. I apologize in advance for this. I'm gonna reverse the, uh, the picture to my face. Three, two, one. Is it in sync? All right. Um. One second. I have to like get the phone into my body on my shirt under my jacket because my uh, my pants won't dry it off. There we go, a little better. It's not in sync. It's Backstreet Boys. Got it. All right. One sec. Oh, actually, while I'm doing this, let me go here. I think it's I think it's cloud.bellabox.com or something. Uh, cloud. Cloud.bellabox.net. Okay. They said the seven train's not working. I don't know what's wrong with it. Anyone know? I actually don't know what my password is. It's not gonna work. I guess I could log in with GitHub. Okay, let's try that. Ugh, oh, it sent me an email. Hold on. Hi, yeah, yeah. Okay. And let's see if that lets me into Bellabox Cloud. Let's go to my S tier. No, not to realize I have to go to the remotes. It should show that I'm currently streaming. Oh, unless it doesn't because of the. Uh, because it should be on my other phone. Ugh, I don't know. Oh, no, it is. All right, it looks like I can max up the max bit rate. Okay, I don't think it's actually gonna do much. I think this is more of a DJI Mimo setting, actually, if I had to guess. Anyway, my face is gonna be the thumbnail. Uh oh. Oh, seven trades just down for weekend maintenance. Got it. All right, uh, let me see if I can get my umbrella out. Okay. 
Backpack. The backpack is very small, so I'm like no. trying to get it off my shoulders. Alfie! Okay. Oh, the backpack's a little wet, but not too wet. That's good. Find the, uh... Ooh, this pack pad is hot. All my equipment is in the backpack. It's actually heating up quite a bit. It's kind of funny. I have a bunch of, like, two phones, a router, the Bella box on a, on a Ratso Rock 5A. If I didn't have to wear gloves, I think I'd be able to do this better, but... Alright, almost there. Even if they're... Even if they're wet with the hand warmers in them, okay. your hands will still warm up. Let's get the gloves back on. I don't know, this section could work. <sighs> Open. <sighs> okay, I can see the comments again. Oh, you know what I can do actually? I can hold the umbrella in my gimbal hand. Oh no, I can hear my voice. Nope, I can't do that. Can't hold the umbrella in my gimbal hand. Unless, okay. If I hold the gimbal in between these fingers, and then I hold the umbrella in between these fingers, all right, now we're talking. All right, here we go. If it doesn't get windy, it should be all right. I got, no, that guy was looking for Alfie. That was a while ago, sorry. No, I never set my umbrella back in. It still works. I even emailed them, told them like, look out for my warranty thing. And I linked them to the video. Because if you look at Davik's website, it says, send in your umbrella no matter what. At any time, and it'll replace it. And uh, I thought it would be funny for them to see the video that caused it. Because it's literally on stream. Where my umbrella, like, flips and rips off the canopy. But it's not fully ripped off. It still works. I don't know where else to go to test things anymore. The battery on the gimbal still seems to be okay. According to this, I've been going for 80 minutes. Like before, that's that's when the, the uh, no. I first went live on the gimbal. So it's getting a phone call. A blizzard and a horse tornado? Uh-oh. Well, yeah, if you're new and you like this nonsense, feel free. Like, subscribe, and uh, join us for more nonsense. Wow, that guy's out on a unawheel. It's kind of an odd-looking wheel, too. It's, like, really all sorts of set up. I don't know.
Yes. We got snow, we got Angelino over here. Which is quite quite busy actually. It's not super busy, but it's still a little busy. Snowflake went directly to my eyeball. Manny, glad you enjoyed. Thanks for joining. You know, wheelers just showing up. Look like it. It's kind of funny, like nonchalantly roll around in a unibill, like expressionless. It's like the most. Uh, oh, the best out. Yeah. They make it look like it's the most boring thing they could be doing with their expressions. and yards is right now. You know, big as a walk, Sean, one thing I didn't really look into is if the, uh, the pocket can record like a higher quality file while live streaming. Nathan Newman's back, and better than ever. Yeah, it's just all wet. As you can see, the snow is just not doing much right now. I don't know what the temperature is now. Have we not had Nightbot for a little while? I don't know. Maybe that's the weather. What happens to the snow? I feel like this is what you're getting. Maybe we'll get some transformation to something different, but right now, this is what we got. How's the fidelity of the stream at this point? Are we, uh... I did increase the bitrate a little bit on the Bella box, but I don't think... It wasn't even hitting the max bitrate, like... Big as a long shot. When I was looking at the, uh... The current bitrates flowing through... Bella box, it was only like two to three thousand. Like it just wasn't even getting anywhere close to to six thousand or five thousand. So I, I feel like that might be a DJI thing. Maybe I shouldn't let DJI do any of the auto stuff. Maybe I should make DJI put the highest stream possible out and then let uh, Bella box do all of the adjusting. But I, I think I do have to turn off the stream for that. But it shouldn't be actually that hard to do. It'll just be like probably a good like 25 second gap. Because for whatever reason it takes a minute. <laughs> Sharp on the TV, good to hear H for her POV. BNH is closed today, it's Saturday. 
to agree with the approach. All right. In theory, I could go into Hudson Yard shops too, but as soon as you go into Hudson Yard shops, there's gonna be music that's copyrighted immediately, so I can't really do much there. Yes, it is snowing. We essentially captured the beginning of the snow for this promised snowstorm this weekend during the stream. Like when we came when we first came out, it just started. Barely. Audio video good. Good, good. Good. Everything is great, everything is great, everything is great. Good to hear Maria. When they leave my device, there's nothing I can do. Yeah, I can only do so much. But there's still some more I can do. I think uh, DJI stuff is finicky enough as it is, so I should just let it be fixed and let the Bella Box encoder manage the bitrate adjustment. Because I feel like if two different things are, are trying to adjust bit rates, it could just make things wonkier, right? If you have two different uh, bitrate adjusters or whatever, quality adjusters. Zumo store. My fingers are actually getting a little bit, uh, a little bit frosty even in the gloves because uh, the batteries dried out. <laughs> I gotta charge them up. Cold Manning, hello. See ya. Have baby computer live stream. I may, like, if we can get into the part of Hudson Yards, maybe, like, when you first walk into it, it's not so, um, loud, the music, so I can at least warm up my hands a little bit. That might be worth doing. Let's see. Gloves are supposed to be pretty good too, but I guess when you're just holding stuff the whole time without moving your hands or fingers at all, it uh, can only do so much. Test the other mic when the music. Oh, because there's less. Uh, that one picks up less background noise. That's probably not a bad idea. As Ron said, this is actually all completely AI generated. I have, I have, I've hit upon a breakthrough in the ability of AI. And now, we're in the future. <laughs> Someone's trying to park in a nearby garage, which is right here. Actually, a very nice entrance for a garage, considering you know there's not much real estate. Oh, did I just raise the volume on this? I don't want to hear my stream from my stream. Even with the salt. I feel like the salt made that slipperier. Oh, 
All right, one second. <sighs> Gotta readjust. I think I'm gonna try to you hold my umbrella um, just over my, you know, my head, resting on my shoulder, so I can re-grasp the gimbal a little better. All right, a little better. Oh, is Brooklyn snowing more? Interesting. Trying to get sick. Well, hopefully I can't get sick again. You know, there's a little meat market here. Looks like they're actually running low on some meats. This is uh, Esposito meat market. Been here since 1932, apparently. According to the uh, the sign. Rice skull. Yes. Yeah, see? Yeah. actually going to stop or go? Nope, I guess we're going. All right. It was a biker, but she decided to stop because she wasn't sure when the lights were going to change for the cars. Feel the meat. Some of the water off my, my gimbal, my pocket. All right. Still see some Christmas trees in the apartments up ahead. Hello. Hello. Chilly. I feel like I, if I walk faster, maybe I can warm up my hands. Just let the blood circulate. It's not too bad. I'm also curious to see what the lat latency is on this. Actually, Sean, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what I actually have it set to on, in um, YouTube stream. But that's the other good part. I can still set up the container for the YouTube stream at on YouTube so I could reuse my settings from prior streams and still uh, keep all that and then just have OBS link into that and then use the stream for Bellabox Cloud into OBS. It's also one of those streets to get to the Javits Center when there's a uh, convention there. It's a boxing gym here. Is that is the corner to the entrance of the Hudson Yards shops on this block or the next one? I don't remember. Like on this avenue or the next avenue. Guess we'll find out. 
Hey, Strawberry Fields is here. I can tell I'm out because of the rubber pants. Resonating through New York. Something like that. Gas station, $4.99 a gallon right now if you're paying cash. If you're paying credit card, $5.19 a gallon. That's for regular gas. Excuse me. We're kind of on our way to Hudson Yards right now, the shops. First, I want to see if I can go inside and warm up a little bit. Even though I got gloves on. They've just been kind of clamped around my gimbal and my phone. So, not enough circulations. But yeah, we're just testing a different setup in terms of streaming. I'm actually streaming on a completely different device than a phone. And it's using the, uh, this, like, bonded two connections in my backpack. My backpack. Both Verizon AT and AT&T. I can hear my umbrella struggling a little bit. That's all right. I think the Hudson shops are in this app here. Hudson Yard shops. Is Grazny Tolik upset that I walked when it said don't walk? You'll live. Ah, what is this place? It's Pfizer apparently. They have this like really tiny red. I don't even know what to say, like how to describe it. It's like a fabric car. Fabric Volkswagen. Chris has got his electric cars going. No gas for you. Oh, they opened, did they open up the Russian Daughters here? Is that already open? Is this, is, this, is this old news anyway? I like their logo, it's actually kind of clever. Very subtle. R&D there. Designs digital. Hold on, let me finish across the street. The 10 pound super chat. <laughs> Relax, stream is fine. Bitrate, codex, whatever. Have a great new year. Thank you, Designs Digital. Appreciate the support. I know. I get a little wild with this stuff. But I feel like it's part of the enjoyment for me in doing this. I get to, like, optimize and, and tweak and fiddle. and just see what we can do to squeeze out the best. But I, re I, re I do appreciate your support. Thank you very much. Designs digital. All right, we're almost at Hudson Yards. I'll probably try to go inside. Let's see how loud the music is as soon as we go in. I'm gonna have to turn off my other, my phone that I'm watching the chat on, at least until I get inside. Cause I can't like close the umbrella. So let me uh, get across the street. Turn off the chat phone. Okay. Got my umbrella all situated. I need to get it. I can't get my finger through the one of the umbrella holes. Hold on, we're almost there. There's glove fingers. There we go. Almost. Alright. Go. Get the phone. Alright, let's go see how loud it is inside. I don't know why she changed her mind. Alright, let's see. All right, it's not too loud. Let me turn on the other microphone and just let me go off to the side while I reconfigure myself. 
Okay. Take off the glove. Turn this on. Okay. Take off my gloves. All right, how loud is the, is the music? Let me know while I configure all myself. Actually, there's no easy way for me to do this. I, I'll just have to hold my umbrella like this then. Unfortunately, I can't close it up. All right. Okay, I guess we'll try to pass through Hudson Yards and while we dry up and warm up our hands. I turned on the microphone, uh, so hopefully it's even quieter now. All right, then let's go through Hudson Yards. This is also a good test of the uh, of the service inside a store like this. So maybe we can go upstairs even higher and just yeah. Should we just go upstairs even higher? Let's do that. All right, I'm just gonna go up. Gonna make our way through. Yeah, I, we, I also sometimes wonder about people that we used to see a lot of, like, like it's not, uh, not it's not me, it's um, Yes Sir 5075. That was one of the names that uh, I feel like we used to see a lot. Oh, let me, let me, let me use this table for a second. I want to close my umbrella. I'm definitely still a little bit congested, but better than uh, than before. Anyway. All right. Hopefully the music is not super loud with my microphone as we pass by designer dog shops. Designs digital, I don't think it works that way. It does help, but uh, you're not gonna be like immune to any virus. <laughs> if you do load up on vitamins. There's no, like a limitations, like super saturating solutions, but when you get a, when you get a kid in daycare, it's like uh, everything goes out the window. At least that's what I've, what I've gathered. I feel like the delay has increased a little bit on the stream between the, uh, between when I first started and now. Maybe I'm not an ultra low latency, I don't know. Anyway, it's a little quieter right now. There's no music playing in this area. So this area is a little safer in terms of the music.
<laughs> me sniffling is your drinking game, then that means you'll be done in like 10 minutes. Potentially. No, uh, Caleb, uh, Caleb Fraser, I think, was the, uh, it was Caleb something. That was the Empire guy. Anyway, it looks like it's working okay. But let me, let me try something. Oh yeah, I miss the sex bots that we used to have that showed up on the channel sometimes. Let me try to kill the stream and try with a slightly different uh, approach on the DJI app. One second. Um, I think I know how to do this. Give me... Yeah, give me a second. It shouldn't kill the stream completely. It should just temporarily break it. Okay, I'm back, I think. Okay, what I did was I changed the, uh, I changed the way the DJI app handles the bitrate from auto to fixed, just to see if that changes the uh, fidelity of the stream. Make us a long show on, this is, this is the moment. <laughs> I'm gonna go upstairs even more. I think as you get upstairs in this place, the service gets a little weirder, so let's go higher. Let's go higher, and if the music gets too loud, let me know so I can adjust by uh, leaving. <laughs> I'm tying up my dongles, no anesthesia. The other thing is, and if I do this version, how do I... I guess I have to technically end the live stream like that. Uh, and then if I need to use the bathroom, I have to just end it and restart it just the way I did it. And Uniqlo is not that badly priced either, right? Oh, there was a little bit of a buffer there, it looked like. Uh, I'm just getting a little, I'm like right under a speaker. Hopefully that's not uh, too, uh, too much. Uh, so the music gets louder when you go upstairs. Maybe I should go back down. Yeah, the music, I think you can get a little bit closer to the speakers up here because the, the floors are shorter. Let me, uh, let me go back down. The music's too loud up here. We're too close to it. Yeah, let's go back. Let's go back down. I'm gonna go down because of the, uh... I think the ceilings are, no, they're the same height about. I don't know. No, no, they're a little bit shorter up on top. The ceilings are taller. Okay. Much better picture quality. Oh. So, so after I adjust it, it looks better? Yeah, I think the ceilings are higher on this floor. I don't know. Do, are they? They look a little bit higher. I don't know. No, it's just whenever I walk under a speaker. I think I'm under another one right now. Maybe I'll try taking a different escalator and see if there's less speakers when I come up over there. 
Oh, you guys are really not hearing the music that much? Well, if you're not hearing much of the music, that's good. Maybe the little microphone closer to my face is, is knocking it out a little bit. Oh, thanks for liking the stream, Chris. At least all my stuff is drying up while I'm in here. Let me blow on the... All right, good. Oh, they have like the little displays up here too. I wonder where the whole Santa thing is, or was, when they had it. Music isn't loud. Okay, well, I'm pretty much under a speaker right now. Let me know uh, right at this point how loud it is. The music is muffled. Okay, well, I guess we'll find. This is also a test. Like if I if I get in trouble with the music, at least we'll know that we've tested the limits and. Uh, and that's what it is. Like, I feel like if you haven't had buffers yet, this is around the place where we should have a drop in bit rate because, uh, you know, we're like deep inside a building now and we're not on the top floor, we're like on a middle floor. So let me know. And if there's like a drop in quality as well. Thanks, walk show. Oh, Andrew's had some weird issues. On my streams, only mine? That's weird. That's pretty weird. Well, we're using a very different setup today than we usually are, so let me know if it's any any different today than others. Chris Bates is doing a test of the Super Chats. That's very kind of you. Thank you for testing your Super Chats on me, Chris Bates, with a $5 Super Chat. The music's... Oh, that was a weird little glitch. Oh, there's no way to get to the escalators from this side. I was gonna try to go up one more floor. Liquid metal screen, yeah, I thought I saw that on my end too. Andrew, I don't know what's going on, it's weird. We're essentially in Hudson Yards because we're in the shops at Hudson Yards. I got out of the, uh, the winter weather for a little bit to dry up and warm up my hands. And that worked substantially. My hands are very warm. It's very warm in here. Good to hear it's not me. I'm going to take the escalator up higher. They still have tons of unused shop space here. Tons. So I don't know what they're going to do eventually, but... I think, my, I think the plan is to, like, get a backpack shoulder strap on this thing and then uh, and get it up that way. That's the eventual plan. Because it'll be much nicer to free up my hand from like the, uh, the streaming device. But then again, I don't get to show things as easily. It depends on where I turn and stuff. So I don't know. We'll see. I'm sure it'll be more like situation dependent. There's a restaurant here called Miznan. Kind of want to look at the menu. Here's Miznan. They actually have fish and chips here. Yeah, some sort of Mediterranean food, yep. All right, let's keep looking. Uh, again, hopefully the music is not too loud. Stand for lame is not, uh-huh. Some of the, uh, the photo ops are over here. We walked by this area before on a super morning, early morning stream. Music's muffled, great. Thank you, Maria, for the, uh, for the report. H&M is multiple floors here. Big, big store. 
to the, uh, the sales side. Great, Narelle, great. Oh, Mizna means kiosk in Hebrew? Interesting. I mean, H&M is huge here. They have H&M Kids, Zara, which I guess is not H&M. Then they have H&M Man. I didn't know H&M has a man. Glitch again. Huh. Well, liquid metal is better than, like, completely popping out, right? Wow, I just realized how jarring some of the turns are. I think I have to reduce the rotor speed on the, on the pocket. At least I think that'll work. I don't know. I feel like I've seen peak, pick, peak stores in other places too. When the liquid metal happens, is the audio or uh, just the video, liquid metal? I mean, I, if, I'll take Liquid Terminator T2 any day of the week. Ah, oh, this is not open. Escalator to level five is closed. You gotta use the elevators if you wanna go up to level five. Never been up to level five before. Audio went to, ah. It's kind of funny, you know, Chris says short glitch, but James says big glitch. <laughs> Patricia, who's Tom? All right, I guess we should start going back down. Let me take the escalators down. Level five is hero level. Ah, the hero. Maybe I should stop by a restroom. You've seen worse, okay. Big and short, country band glitch. It's like, uh, what's, his, what's the name of that singer? Jelly Roll? Pandora, not the music store. So the restrooms are back there. I'm trying to figure out the, the easiest way I can uh, do the restrooms because I can't like blank out the stream like I can in the other one. I think I have to end the live stream and then rejoin it when I'm done. So I think I'm gonna pop by. I mean, I've been, we've been going for a little while now, right? So I, th I think the restrooms are, yeah, they're back here. So let me, it's an acceptable glitch, okay. Great. Yeah, let me let me let me go. Let me go to the bathroom real quick. I think the only way I can easily do that is by by ending that stream like I did the last time when I changed the bitrate. So let me do that again, and then uh, it should re it should reconnect when I'm done. All right. So let me let me set that up. All right. If you can still hear me, I'll be right back in a. Uh, in a, in a couple of minutes, maybe two minutes at most.
way back. reason like the Bella box encoder decided it was gonna completely error out I don't know why this charging yeah anyway Let's go back down and see what happens. Oh, hold on, hold on. The music, the music is going to be loud on this one. I forgot to turn the receiver on. Uh, is this working? There we go. Okay, the receiver's back on. Hopefully that blocks out the music more. Yeah, sorry. Thanks for reminding me about the music. Loyal fan stayed. Thank you for sticking around while I figured out what was going on. It was really strange. Uh, the encoder like didn't want to resume itself, so I just restarted the encoder box, which was actually a relatively painless process. I thought it was going to be much worse, but the it actually boots up very quickly. All right, let's uh, keep going down. I think one more level. Oh yeah, but the escalators are uh, by the coffee shop. Okay. very lounge music. Well, hopefully it's not super copyrighted. Is that Mark Wahlberg? <laughs> yeah, that wasn't the issue. <laughs> if only. No, yeah, I just, I, I couldn't get the stream to resume. <laughs> I guess you could, uh, you could take that in multiple ways also. <laughs> Yeah, the DJI mic sounds like it actually does a pretty good job at isolating my voice and uh, reducing background noise. Which is, I guess is why people don't necessarily want it when I'm outside streaming in the city. You kind of want the ambient noise if you want the experience of New York. That's another reason I don't really like... Um, I don't know where I was going with that. That's another reason for something, but I, I completely lost my train of thought. Anyway, we're on the bottom floor now. We can see what things are looking like outside now. We warmed up sufficiently. All right, music is gone now, so I guess I could turn off the microphone. I can't really tell what the actual situation is like outside, so let's go see. It appears to be still snowy but like wet you can see that it's immediately melting as soon as it hits the ground so it's not it's not anything super pleasant so it sounds like I need to get my gloves back on my umbrella back out and uh, set up my my holding the way I was before again and bodily designs no buffers on the black screen that's good yeah when when you see a black screen only that's connected directly to my home computer, OBS stream. All right, let me um, let me glove up, get this uh, get this figured out. I'll briefly uh, can chat a little bit while I do that. We're right by the vessel in the Hudson Yards. It's uh, still something you can't go in or up. You can go in the bottom and take photos. I don't know what kind of uh, process that involves, but if I, I'm going to try going to the High Line. What time is it right now? 4.49. So, not sure how much time I actually have left, but let me see. Let me check my phone. Um, uh, okay.
Okay. Keep that elevated. Let me just see before I get too far. Let's see my browsing history. Uh oh. I'm not using that Zhiyun today. It's all Pocket 3. Didn't bother updating Nightbot since this is just a test. Do not adjust your screens. Only a test of the emergency system. All right, let me get my umbrella. No, let me get the phone. Put it in between my legs. Yeah, I said that. Because if I, I keep, once I put my gloves on, I cannot get my phone out of my pocket. So... just walk directly into that chain. Okay, and then I'm going to get my umbrella open. Which involves my teeth. Put it on my shoulder. Re-grab the, the, the Pocket 3 a specific way. So I can hold the umbrella and the gimbal. And that looks, that looks and feels pretty good. Take my chat phone. Because this is what I resorted to now. Use my face to unlock it. Swipe up. Swipe up. Um, swipe up, but don't do that. Okay. Let me know how things are. Maria doesn't like that wet snow. Makes it feel colder faster. Well, yeah, anytime you start to get wet in the... Uh, in cold water, in cold weather, wet, wet and cold weather, you get cold extra fast. Just watch Outdoor Boys, Luke. Is Big as a Walk Sean still here? Will the real Big as a Walk Sean please stand up? Please stand up. Please stand up. All you other Big and Walk Sean's are just imitating. All right, it's a little windy on the High Line. Doesn't really help my umbrella. Oh boy. Something in my mouth too. Unknown, unknown liquid is one in my mouth. As long as I, like, I can't really see where I'm going right now because of the way I have to hold my umbrella. But as long as people follow the instructions of staying on the right where they walk, it should all be fine. Um, is that going to happen? That's the question. All right. This was a mistake. The High Line uh, was a mistake with the umbrella. Oh, you hear, do you hear the creaking? Oh, gosh. Okay. I can't do this. Hold on. All right. All right. Too windy on the highway. Under my armpit. All right, fine. We're back to umbrellaless mode. Ah, oh, that's bad. Umbrellaless mode is bad. Why is it so windy right now? It was not windy at all before. Like a parasail. Not, oh yeah, you could you could see the wind up ahead when it's really farting around the snow. But you can see everyone's workstations that they they set up all their computer workstations to overlook the high line from their fancy apartments. Makes sense if you're gonna have to sit and work at your computer. Someone's about to watch Paw Patrol. Oh no, it's just a Google Google, uh, whatever, Apple TV menu screens. Slip back. Oh, I gotta work on my juvie slide. Does everyone work on their juvie slides? Arzi, hello. Sorry if I missed any chats. I had some technical difficulties with my umbrella. 
and uh, I've given up on it at the moment. Whether that's the right move, I don't know yet. Uh, We're gonna find out. Eduardo Brazil, hello, Lee is here. Did I miss you before? Might have. You have no idea. What? You have no idea. Is what he said, I think. Oh, a piece of snow, just like. You ever like look the wrong way when it's snowing and like a piece of snow finds that perfect gap between your chin, your neck, and your coat and lands like right on your clavicle, right on the skin. I think everyone's going to get mad if I get sick again. I mean, it's, it's snowing pretty good. The problem is the snow melts as soon as it hits anything. It might as well be rain. It's just, it's just rain that falls a little bit slower right now. <laughs> Slow falling rain, that's all it is. Uh, at least we'll have some scaffolding to protect us in a little bit. Slick back. <laughs> Top five tourist attractions. Oh, I can't even read right now because of the water. Statue of Liberty. On oh, the USA, Grand Canyon, Times Square, Golden Gate. Disneyland? Disneyland does not rank higher than Disney World. In no, in no, uh, in no book would that be accurate. We are trying. We have a husband and a Let's look back. Yeah. Alright, well here's the plan. If I can make it to the end of the High Line, we're gonna go to uh, we're gonna go to Chelsea Market. And then and then that's it. We're going to Chelsea Market. That's all I gotta say. That's gonna be the final portion of my test. I can't, can't get my, uh, uh-oh, I made it worse. I'm trying to view my stream at the same time as I'm streaming it, so I can read the chat, but also look at the, uh, the video, the view, to see if it looks okay. So far it looks okay. I mean, New York got snow, but this is not the snow people want. People want the, uh, myself. Somehow I pressed the volume button. People want the snow that sticks and uh, accumulates. I'm going to have to pick up the pace a little bit because I'm like, I've decided to go umbrella list at the moment, so I'm just going to move a little quicker and see. It's kind of calmed down the wind a little bit, but of course as soon as I say that, if I open it, my umbrella that is, it's just going to be bad again. Anyway, we are on the High Line right now, on a snowy, uh, well, wintry mix more at this point. January, Saturday, late afternoon, early evening. I had a gigantic lunch, so I'm not particularly hungry. I was hoping this walk would uh, generate some more hunger, but anyway. That's a me problem. Is that city? That's okay. Or is this? I can't read the full city. So I can't. I can't see everything right now. The water droplets are accumulating on my chat phone, and uh, that causes causes distortion in the text. You know what I mean. Curtain call. I know what this one is now. I think this is 23rd Street, so we're not too far from uh, from Chelsea Market. But at least we also get to see some low light performance of the Pocket Three. It actually looks quite bright on the Pocket Three, brighter than uh, I think it's good. They don't want to close their their curtains. That's on them. 
right? What do we eat for lunch? Hot pot at home. Home hot pot. It's good. I mean, once you cook a bunch of stuff in that broth, like the meat, the vegetables, whatever the soup base you use, and then the sauce, the sauce is what makes hot pot, to me anyway. I like making my own concoction. You know, soy sauce, some uh, cilantro, some scallions, garlic powder, peanut sauce. I actually like to put some of that Korean uh, samjang, I think it's called, paste. There's different types of the paste they have. Some are spicier than others. And a fish sauce, too. It's very good. All right, I'm gonna try opening the umbrella again. One second. Oh, it's bad. Here we go. Oh, it opened, it opened, okay. Good. Hold on. I'm like, I might be holding the chat and like blocking people right now. So if I did that, I'm sorry. Like I just realized that as I was holding the phone, I was causing additional presses on the screen. Because <laughs> right now I don't think I'd be able to unlock the phone with my face. It's too dark. The pixel, oh gosh. Now I'm typing. Hold on. The water on the uh, screen. Oh boy. There we go. So if anybody became a moderator or something, I'm sorry. Or before it got banned, like suddenly. All right, well, there's like 18 of them, and they're all somehow taking up more space than me, so they can walk around me with their umbrellas. Well, of course they're taking up more space than me, but it shouldn't be that hard for me to pass them. Gerard likes the Pocket 3. Picture quality, glad it's good. I did mess around with some settings. Pickles and Walk Sean, I guess, had to go. I might have missed your exit. Because when I tried to get the real Pickles and Walk Sean, please stand up. Didn't work. Wow, is that the one? Is that someone's apartment or not? Boy, uh, wow, they got a full on house in there. The two floors. Wow. Do <laughs> Well, hopefully you guys are enjoying. We are capturing some interesting uh, views. People are home at the... Uh, someone's about to watch Toy Story 3 in this apartment. Again, they should close for curtains. <laughs> Uh-oh. The phantom touches on my screen. Hold on. There we go. Okay. Let me try to keep moving through best I can. It gets very narrow here. I only have so much room I can maneuver because of the way I'm hooked up. We could exit here and go directly to the High Line from 17th Street, but... Maybe I should consider doing something like that, popping out at the next exit. Just to, uh... Eh, no, we might as well finish the High Line if we're on the High Line. Right? Oh! Oh, jeez! <laughs> yeah, I'm alright, thanks. Yeah, that's it's... God, thanks. 
Yeah, they, they, <laughs> I fell. It got very slippery. The, um, <sighs> the, the, they put out mats because it's so slippery out here. But yeah, I'm fine. I've gotten pretty good at falling. <laughs> what else is gonna happen today? Who knows? No one's gonna know what happens. <laughs> Lawsuit. I'm gonna sue the city. Nah. I gotta get to the to the Chelsea Market. Falls or not, somebody clip that. Clip it. Hold on. Let me wipe my phone. I can't see. But yeah, I'm fine. Sorry. Thanks. Thanks everyone for your concern. <laughs> there's only just, there's like certain. Oh gosh. There's just certain parts of the High Line that are very um, slippery during this kind of weather. They even, they knew that too. They put out, um, they passed the fall test. Well, my watch started vibrating. I don't know. I don't think this watch that I have has fall detection. I think it's probably, that'd be kind of funny if I hit my stairs goal after I fell. <laughs> All right, we're close, we're close. Remember, my goal is Chelsea Market right now. Uh, it's not salted, but they put out a couple of um, carpets in that one area. RC. <laughs> $2 super chat for JG Wentworth. 877 cash now. I need those guys, you know, the ones that put up the billboard where it says, got hurt? Good. <laughs> That's the ones I need. Aw, oh, man. My umbrella can't withstand um, uh, gusts of winds anymore until I replace it. All right, you know what? I think I'm going to come down at this exit. I'm not going to go all the way to the end of it, just so we can get to the uh, Chelsea Market faster. And once I finish it, I'm going to be extra careful on the stairs. Oh yeah, the stairs are pretty slippery. I'm going to be extra careful. Oh man, it's like the, the wind is creating like a little wind tunnel effect in here. I should have taken the elevator so I could uh, sing. Oh well. Too late now. At least we know I can still take the stairs after my fall. Let's see a Ford Bronco. Oh, there's like uh, water droplets on the lens, I think. I'm gonna go in the back door. Hold on, let me see if I can wipe it off a little bit. All right, let's go in the back door. All right, what else did I miss? A oh, warm chair and a nice drink, I'll take it. Better call Saul. Like a bad SNL sketch? Not a good one? Remember, I still want to host SNL. Would they let me do it after I fell during a live stream? Imagine I fell on my back. <laughs> that would break everything in the... Uh... But I kind of adjusted myself to not fall on my back. We're by the Rivian store. Or the Rivian showroom. Tesla has the Cybertruck on display in theirs. All right. Well, the goal right now is just to get to Chelsea Market, and then uh, what are the Rivians out here? I don't know if they're going for a test drive right now. I think they might be. And then there's an empty showroom over here. Ready for Tesla to move in. 500 witnesses. Oh boy.
Let me stand under this uh, high line. Uh, there's a lot of cars waiting to come this way. All right, this looks like I still have, I don't know, there's no easy way for me to wipe off the, uh, the lens because of the, none of my fabric is, is absorbent that I'm wearing right now. My gloves are not, my jacket is not. I guess that's true, Lee. The, the gimbal was a smooth fall, so can we just say I didn't fall at all? Can we go that far? Probably not. There's definitely a change in, uh, in altitude of the, uh, of the stream. All right, I'm gonna close the umbrella as we get closer to the door, and then uh, I'll try to resume. Okay. Oh, when someone said, okay, okay, that was the giveaway. Yeah, I was just tying my shoes, don't worry. All right, let me uh, try to sneak in here. Let me know how the service is gonna be. We're going into our nemesis zone. That's the uh, Chelsea market, which never works well for live streamers. Thank you, thanks. All right, let me try to open this door. No one else is coming in. All right, here we go. Let me know how things look. For those who don't know, this is the um, this is the big test. For live to see if we can actually walk through Chelsea Market without too many hiccups. Oh, there's already something. Anyway, the goal is to get through Chelsea Market without completely dropping out. Oh, we're getting some Terminator. Where's Big as a Walk Sean? But how bad is it? Remember, remember it got pretty bad last time with yeah, this very nice though. Very nice. Okay, not too bad. It glitched but didn't fully stop. Okay. Okay. I mean, if it's working. Oh, we're at 600 likes. Awesome. Thanks, everyone. Hopefully people enjoyed the, the snow stream. And more importantly, hopefully people enjoyed me falling in the street. Oh, not even in the street, in the high line. I mean, having a nice high line fall. It has any footage says buffer zone. Oh, yeah, there's more buffers now. But the best part about all this is the stream. The stream can't fully die. The stream cannot fully die in this moment. Actually, I also think, because of the way this is set up, that you can't actually, um, that you wouldn't lose your place in the live stream, because technically OBS is what's streaming. So you shouldn't even have to press the live button to catch up. Oh, we passed by another Miznan. Picture is slightly diminished. Okay. All right. I wanted to stop by the gingerbread area that we never really got to see a picture of before because it was so bad. People catching the tail end of the holidays, trying to get the end of their vacations, and I think. 
Thanks, Tracy. I'll change my name so that what you said was accurate. I also think we sound quite a bit different. Oh yeah, is it like satsanyuk or something today? The best trip through Chelsea Market to date? I'll take it. Molly, I don't know how far, how much you missed. We're in Chelsea Market now for one of the best walkthroughs we've ever had through it. I think we're near the end of it all. What's this one going to be? Empty shop, but a pretty big space. All right, almost out. All right. So how was that? Is there a glitchy buffer again? All right, we'll, we'll say that's a pretty successful walk through Chelsea. Again, it's not as busy as uh, as the other times you walk through here. So it's not just the it's not just the the, uh, the building itself. It's the crowds too. Oh, there's a big buffer there. Seems like we're getting a big buffer at the end there. Okay, but I think, oh no, you do have to keep clicking the live button to catch up. All right, so a little bit of a buffer there at the end. But you guys never lost the red dot. How long was that last one for? So it seems like the exit was kind of wonky, but yeah, it's still snowing, but again, it all turns into water as soon as it, as soon as it lands. I guess I could keep trying to walk if it's not too windy, but I need the umbrella, I think. Let's see. All right, one second. Let me go, let me go off to the end here of the scaffolding, maybe. So I can... So I can adjust in a little bit more open of an area. Okay. All right. Hopefully the wind isn't going to be too bad now that we're off the high line. All right. Okay. Upwards and onwards. I think I also have to like hold the. Let me, let me also get away from like Eighth Avenue, Ninth Avenue, really. Maybe being more in the city will help. Three to four seconds is the last buffer. Okay, not too bad. It still sounds like it's better than whatever it was the last time that we actually tried to go through there. All right, I'm pretty sure this last one just ran the red, and now it's just gonna stop right in front of the crosswalk, which isn't really helpful for us. So 
I mean, overall, I, I feel like that was a pretty... Still part of Google over here. I feel like that was a pretty good test through... Uh, uh, it's a super narrow sidewalk. For whatever reason, the Google sidewalk around their building is super narrow. I gotta change this umbrella. <laughs> Across the street, maybe it's a little less narrow on that side. Yeah, see, my knee only slightly hurts after the fall. Philippe downtown. Oh, Philip Chow. Uh, yeah, they have that place in Midtown. I remember now. Where was Bagels and Walk Sean for all this? He missed my fall. He missed. No, it's not his fault. Things get busy with a, uh, a baby. But uh, hopefully he also was able to get out a little bit and record some of the snowy weather. The umbrella is Davik. I don't know if I put it in my... my I, I thought I was going to add it to my uh, description, but I don't think I fully did. I couldn't, I couldn't get around any easier way over there. Davik. Uh, Dave Kang is the name of the person who created it. Uh, and it, the name of the umbrella is just Davik. It's just the first name, last initial. What's good? No, not tailbone. I didn't fall on my back at all. Actually, uh, coccyx... Coxigial fractures can be quite painful. They take a while to heal, and there's not much you can do about them. It's just gonna be painful sitting for like six weeks. But I didn't, I didn't hurt that. But frankly, I would rather hurt that than like an actual joint that needs to be used every day. But maybe that's just me. This is a 14th Street train station here. ACE trains can be caught. You can also catch the L. FedEx doing deliveries on a Saturday. Actually, their home delivery service does deliver Saturdays. But not Mondays or something weird. And FedEx Ground delivers Mondays and Fridays, but not Saturdays. Even though home delivery is just FedEx Ground that delivers on Saturdays. It's kind of weird. What was that noise just now? I heard a bunch of screaming and noise, but I don't know what it was. I see nothing else going on, so I guess it was nothing. Oh, so the white is sleeting, and then it looks like the rain is more blue lines. All right, fine. Alright, I feel like I'm not... I can't see any of the chats if I do. Let me catch up a little bit. Ah, change the climate so I don't need an umbrella. I'm working on it. Over 600 likes. Awesome. Thanks, everyone. Yeah, we want proper snow. We don't want this, like... Uh, this is just, like, glorified rain. This is rain that falls slowly. That's all. This will soak you fast. Broken table will take months to heal. Ask me snowboard. Yeah, those snowboarders could do take a lot of uh, butt falls, and yeah, toxic is not a fun one to break. Tibial plateau fractures are no joke, because not not you're not only like it's potent you could potentially have it surgically repaired, but even if you do, you still are gonna have a period of like having requiring the knee immobilizer 
and uh, and and not being allowed to put any weights. Your knees got to be straight for however long the orthopedic surgeon determines, and then you'll start a pro a program of. You know they'll 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 allow a flexion into the brace. It's going to be like a Bledsoe brace with a certain amount of degrees unlocked, and then eventually you could start putting weight on it. But it's a very long process. It's a very tough one to deal with tibial plateau fractures. People all falling on their asses all over the city. Yep. This stream included. I should have cursed more when I fell, right? That, what did I even say other than blah, 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 like Arnold Schwarzenegger? <laughs> well, I mean, Will Sass is imperson impersonation of Arnold Schwarzenegger. Oh, as big as I walk Sean back? You have been filming. Very good. That was my hope that that's what you've been doing. Come probably in one hand, give one the other. Yeah. I, I, you don't even know what I, wanna, what I look like right now. You don't want to know. If I can find a mirror, I'll show you how I'm like cuddled over my my, my devices with my umbrella against my body. Why did I say body like that? I don't know. You see me in here? Nah, you can't see the reflection in there. All right. I took a tumble on the. Uh, on the high oh you were still listening in the background. I took a tumble on the high line. I tried to do a barrel roll, it didn't work. Do a barrel roll. I can't see anything right now. And I think a piece of snow went in my eye. It should have recovered already, so maybe it wasn't snow. Oh well. Why not have an eye injury on top of everything else? There's a rubber pants for the catheter spill, yes. Oh, you forgot your gloves? Oh man, I'm sorry to hear that. This is tough without gloves if you're filming too, because holding these devices, your hands chill out fast. At least, you know, maybe the gimbal, at least if you're using the pocket, hopefully it's heating up a little bit to warm up your hand. I feel like I actually feel a little bit through my left glove. A little tiny bit. <laughs> Not a bicycle. That, that, that engine sound kind of gave it away. That's definitely a bicycle. <laughs> you know, when, when the bicycle can rev, I think, uh, I think that's how you know it's a legitimate bicycle. Oh, you want to see how much of your footage is, is uh, usable? I think it might not be so bad. I feel like water drop on, on the lenses, depending ex if it's in a very exact spot, it can get pretty bad. But if it's just off center, it might not be too bad. I guess you'll see. Unfortunately, it's still hard to read some of the chats on the phone because the droplets on the phone screen are distorting the text. It's an annoying thing to, to manage with, but it's fine. Lizard bites slipped on the ice today. Took a knee to break the fall. Hopefully your knee's okay. I feel like using your knees to break a fall isn't uh, isn't the best either. I mean, at least it looks like it's snowing, you know. There's definite snowflakes coming down, it's just not... If you only looked at the picture of the ground, you would never know that it's snowing. Oh, right by Weststone. Their furniture is, is designed to self-destruct in two years. You know, as soon as the warranty's over, whatever it is. Like, it looks very nice otherwise. And it's expensive. Not as expensive as those, like, Italian stores on Madison Avenue, but... Still.
Yeah, I mean, a toddler falls like five times a day without any like lasting injuries, but if I fell five times in a day, I feel like at least two of those times I'd probably break something. <laughs> Ah, seeing where else started here, but hopefully it was not too bad. All right, Sixth Avenue again. There was a big Bed Bath and Beyond store that is now just the Beyond, and it's gone. We're good. Oh, well, I don't know what's going on up ahead, but. Anyway, Ron took a fall, probably hasn't recovered yet well. Hopefully me falling on stream helps uh, restore some of your pride. You got the sh you got me falling on the clip. I have no idea. I don't know how YouTube clips work. It's not like uh, Twitch, I don't think, right? I mean, they did it because Twitch did it, but I don't know exactly how it would work. Oh yeah, you can see the residual Bed Bath and Beyond uh, the empty store that's left of Bed Bath and Beyond, completely empty. I'm not going to go inside at this point, but there it is. Share it to Discord. Oh boy. All right, let me uh, continue on. I'm not gonna step on those subway grates. Those are a uh, a trap in this kind of weather. They get very, very slippery. All right, let me go keep going in towards Fifth Avenue. I also don't think it's actually that easy to end the live stream anymore. I think I, I have to say like goodbye, turn everything off, and then like log into my computer remotely and actually end the container in OBS. It's kind of funny. Oh, here, you can take a look inside Bed Bath & Beyond from here too. All cleaned out. I wonder what they're gonna put here. It's a giant space, absolutely huge. With a, with a lower level, too. That was much smaller than the upper level, but still, they had a lower level and it goes all the way down, like, half the avenue. I can make a short with the fall? I probably should. Can someone, like, you know, remix it, with, like, into a song? Where my, my falling sounds like... Oh, 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 oh. Something ridiculous? David, I'm sorry to hear it to go through that, but I'm glad to see that you've uh, put it behind you. Ooh, that's a lot of liquid just falling. Oh yeah, that bath. I did look at like a dance studio. I wonder if this is actually a, the old delivery. To, like, it, it, could this be a way to get stuff inside the Bed Bath & Beyond? I don't know. What is this place? Embellishment, hole punches, stencils. Oh my. L cool chase. Mama said knock you out. Dough. Dough has good donuts. I feel like 
for me, out of most donuts that, like, uh... They go a little wild trying to make them extra fancy with, like, fillings and super frosted toppings and extra toppings on the frosting. But I feel like I'd like a good, proper, classic glazed donut. And I think dough does that really well, as does, uh... As does uh, Krispy Kreme. This one is boss. Everyone is, uh. Yeah. I think that was a Volvo. No, it's a Lexus. Oh, the Volvo, the Volvo is in front of the Lexus. Sorry. If Gern is here, there's a Volvo. So, we got it all today. We got Falls, Volvos. Is what live? Am I live? I am live. It's 34 degrees now. Still above freezing, technically. You could get some snowfall and actually stickage at this temperature, I think. It just has to be a lot more snow. Oh, my nose revving up a little bit. I think Cash Jordan put out a video on uh, no Walmarts in New York, right? <laughs> but yeah, it had, we've hadn't had a Walmart in New York City limits, and I doubt we ever will. Right, the phone is so wet. I cannot read anything, and I can't, I can't like dry it out either. I have nothing to wipe it against that's gonna actually, you know, absorb liquid without just smearing it over everywhere. There's probably nowhere else I can really like go inside to hide out. I guess Italy, right? Italy you can go into. That might be a good place to go. Is Italy still open? can't see the Empire State Building. It's kind of behind that uh, new skyscraper that's coming up. Yeah, let me cross back. Maybe we'll try to go to Italy. So I can at least, like, read the chat for a little bit. Cars trying to turn. I can't tell how many cars are behind them. There's way too many cars in the city right now. For whatever reason, all my, my Reddit, it's like, if you just use the regular Reddit feed, sometimes it just starts showing you popular subreddits that you don't follow. And I've been seeing so many, I canceled my Amazon Prime subscription membership posts it's kind of funny I don't know also I feel like Amazon Prime took away my uh, my ability to order anything with same day shipping on my account because if Mrs. Commuter uses her own account she could still get same day shipping and I don't even think she has Prime on her account so you just pay for it oh no she does have Prime because I shared it I shared it with her through a family membership, and somehow she's able to get it. All right, I don't know. Whatever. There's way too many cars. Well, maybe this might be the first time I don't have to wait for the light to change to cross the street. In a while. Maybe he has been putting out a little bit more, like, uh, you know, less upbeat content. But sometimes, you know, sometimes you gotta follow the algorithm. Follow your nose. I guess. Ah, oh, I can't read this. Come on. Ah. Alright, we're almost to 23rd Street. And then hopefully I can get inside Italy. 
I don't know how well streams work in there, but uh, as eight seconds left across the street, I kind of want to try to make it. Five seconds. This guy's not walking the right way. Ah, oh, these guys are stopping right on. The... Like they finish crossing the street and they stop right in front of the intersection where you're trying to go. It's great. Lego store. I wonder how busy they are right now in this weather. Not super, but still a lot of people inside considering. But there's no giant line outside anyway. All right, let me let me try to get to uh. Ah, to Italy. Where's the entrance to it? Under this uh, scaffolding, maybe? Is this one of the main entrances? No, they tried to go in there, it was closed. Where's like the main entrance? Can you get in through here? Let me, uh, let me get my phone between my legs so I can shut down this umbrella. Okay. Okay. That's not good. Now, let me put my gloves away. Not so easy, actually. Okay. All right. Completely soaked. Hold on. Alright. Oh, is Adam here? Overcheck 75? There might be some, some bad weather out. We're not sure yet. This whole thing, the gimbal is really wet right now. This pocket is. I'm very concerned that it's just not gonna. <laughs> Last time we were in Italy on a live stream, but here we are now. I'm very wet. Adam, you missed me falling earlier. They claim it was clipped. Ah. Italy is a cool place. I mean, you can get some very nice produce here, but you are going to pay a pretty penny for it. You can even get, I think they have like, um, I think they have. Salmon grade, salmon grade tuna here. I mean, I think it has to specifically say that it's salmon uh, sushi grade. Did I, say, did I say salmon grade tuna? I meant sushi grade. It would say if it was. We're in a place called Italy right now. It's essentially like a gourmet marketplace of fancy ingredients and potentially some imported things as well. Smoked salmon pastrami is in the window. I mean, they got the, the butcher here. I mean, this is a fancy butcher. La macelleria. Macelleria. Maybe. Ah, the slippy fish, huh? Yeah, I went inside here because I'm kind of done with the outside right now. Um, and I think Italy was a nice break from, uh, from the outside. But they're like... Pizza alla palla. They got it all. David's getting hungry. I mean, I think they're like they're making uh, making sausage here, essentially.
Let's seal it up. It's kind of cool that they set up a whole restaurant here. Il, il Pesce. Pesce? Pesce? But, uh... I don't know that I want to be sitting here dining in the middle of like a... Uh, <laughs> in the middle of a, a grocery store, kind of. I mean, I know it's, an, it's a fancy grocery store, but... <laughs> Tunnel of the outside. Yes, I need to start an emo band. I think there's a rooftop you can get to. Yeah, right here, Sarah. Rooftop. off holiday stuff Sarah Paramore glad you're enjoying sound was all swishy oh that's probably because I have water in the microphones maybe I can go back to this one temporarily I switched to a different microphone maybe that'll uh Oh, this is an exit again. Let me head back towards the exit that's more on Madison, uh, towards that Madison Square Park. And then I, I might actually just start signing out. People are enjoying themselves, which is nice to see. Yeah, I turned on the other microphone to, uh, to limit that. You get all your cheese, all your cheese needs can be met here as well. If you do have cheese needs and they can't be met here, you might have cheese needs that are way too, uh, cheese needs that are too, uh, uh high end. I'm just going to try to get through towards the exit towards Madison Square Park. Audio is lower on this mic, got it. I think it's because it's not fully in my direction. People are walking back, like when you, when you start walking backwards, I feel like, you know, it's not the place. So one of the things you can't do if you walk backwards is um, uh, watch where you're going. That's uh, it's a critical, critical part of it all. Oh, they have like some self-checkout areas too? I didn't realize that. Uh, let me walk off to the side here, maybe. That's an exit that you can't get into that door anyway, so let me kind of stand over here for a moment. Because I don't think we can exit that way. <sighs> okay. I think that's about it. We may have, we've done what we could. And I gotta go back outside, but I think I'm not gonna do it again with the uh, with the equipment. I think the equipment needs a break, and uh, so, so do my arms. Cheesy cheese needs. Tavis gonna have some microwave popcorn. You know who has really good microwave popcorn? Kirkland. Kirkland has some really good. Uh, you know, Costco's brand. They got a good one. Oh, is Mercury Moment still around? Did I miss it? Oh, you're eating and flushing and downing sake. Mercury Moments is having a good day. I could use some sake. Adam has 7th Street Burger in front of you. Are they actually on 7th Street? How did they get to you? <laughs> awesome, we had a pretty high like number two. Nova was making curry in a hurry. I think that's a restaurant on uh, 28th and Lex. 29th and Lex? 28th and Lex? Somewhere over there. Curry in a hurry. Ron, again, my condolences. And I, and I hope we did a little bit to, to take your mind off things. I know that uh, it's, never, it's never easy. Never easy. And even time doesn't heal everything, but memories. We got those. Drink a Lavazza coffee. Stefan says the best. Yeah, what are we at the likes right now? I can't even tell. Based on uh, 
Can I like my own stream? Oh, it won't let me. It won't let me like my... Oh, no, it let me. I, I was able to like my own stream. <laughs> anyway. Keep, you, you, I'm gonna, it's probably going to take me like an extra 30 seconds to shut down the stream after I say goodbye because of the way this is all set up. There's so much water still in my gimbal. In my pocket, I mean. Pocket three. So I'm trying to just blow it all out. Anyway, thanks again for joining uh, today's stream. It was a good test, I think. This was pretty good. I feel like there's still some room we could do with the bitrate. Biggest walk, Sean, I did switch about half... In the Hudson Yards, I switched the DJI MIMO mode. <laughs> MIMO mode. To um, high quality from auto. So DJI's app shouldn't be trying to adjust the quality. So I don't know if things changed in terms of the fidelity of the stream after that point. You know, minus Chelsea Market, that was its own thing. But um, I don't know. I'll have to review later on the replay to see what things are looking like. Anyway, yeah, I, I ended up plugging in the, the pocket with the charger a little while ago um, when we left. Uh, I don't remember exactly when I did it, but... Yes, Adam, it is, I think. I, I think I might have... No, I don't think I ever had it recorded. Yeah, I don't think I ever recorded it before. Yeah, me too, Strawberry Fields. Peter, I hope that, um, you know, those are tough, but if it's a peripheral nerve thing, hopefully, uh, you know, with time, maybe, but a lot of times, if, it's, if, it, if, it, if an EMG, electromyography, nerve connection study is fine, that kind of stuff, you know, it's going to take a while. Peripheral nerves can recover, but if it, it depends on the cause, too. If it's uh, related to a chronic thing, then... then those are tougher if it's a more of an acute injury than maybe but uh but hope thing hope things do better improve oh yeah i do remember jenny strides has had some like some scary incidents on streams and not just ones that were like you know those kinds but like questionable people too from what i remember so his his uh Subscribership is well deserved. Anyway, yeah, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go get uh, go uh, home and rest. Oh, we hit the 700 likes. Awesome. Thanks, everyone. We lost the like. Somebody's not not happy about hitting that 700 goal. The gim will usually hide your slip. Yeah, the slips it can hide, but I think the fall is a big change in altitude. You know, if the gimbal if the gimbal goes all the way to the floor. <laughs> Everyone keeps trying to get in the door next to me, but it's locked. But um, I guess you can't really tell. Ooh, AK found a train track in Boston. Yeah, I mean, if you walk everywhere, you know, you're going to eventually fall somewhere, right? It's like, what? what's the greatest risk for falling is walking, right? You can't really fall if you're not up on your feet. I guess you could fall out of bed, but, you know, you know what I mean. I think you know. Anyway, yes, thanks again, everyone, for joining. Appreciate the Super Chat, Super Stickers, PayPal, Patreon, memberships. Uh, welcome to the new folks. Hopefully you stick around, subscribe if you haven't already, if you're listening. But, of course, thanks to the subscribers. And if you're not listening, thank you. If you're not subscribing, you're listening. I mean, thank you anyway. We, too, appreciate you spending your time. And, of course, a big thanks to the mods. So I think now I have to start the process of shutting this all down. Uh, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to... You're not going to hear anything anymore after I click end live stream. And then uh, I have to actually log into my computer and properly end it. <laughs> so until our next test or our next commute, uh, have a great rest of the weekend if I don't see you until Monday. And uh, yeah, see you then. All right. Bye.